turn on the radio all right guys so um i wanted to try something new i'm headed to a thrift store right now but um i wanted to ask you guys just let me know your answer in the comments down below because if i post like almost daily videos where i just take it along with me um i can get more videos out like i'll keep showing you guys me going to the thrift stores what i pick up at the thrift stores um but i could do that on uh more i could do that way more often so it's like i'd probably be able to post like a video every other day at most every three days um yeah it's raining pretty hard right now but let me know what you guys think about this kind of video i mean watch it first and then if you guys would still rather watch um full-on trip to the thrifts and let me know but yeah let's just get this day started let's go it's raining a little bit so i got the super beat stone smith so over here at the thrift let's go so i found a couple pieces i found this may 30th 1999 little nascar too it's got the home depot back to back 200 laps all over the thing. pretty dope indianapolis 500 too big though this right here is pretty dope it's the u.s postal service olympic sponsored jacket pretty clean and then this um janet jackson tee it's not vintage this is 2015 so probably gonna pass on this one found three crazy pieces right here found a vintage nutmeg san francisco 49ers 1994 this one right here is crazy scott Braden, 1995-1996, back-to-back racing, logo athletic, dead stock with the tag. This is right there, Scott Braden, 1995, back-to-back, pole winner, crazy shirt. And then right here, this is nuts. Planet Hollywood, charging 15 though. I don't know if I can leave this, because this is ridiculous. This is crazy. Just came across a vintage Tommy Hill figure, size small. This could fit a girl, but this is for kids. But this is a pretty dope piece. It's got the hoodie underneath right here. Just zip thing. So, cop. Vintage guest bag. <laughs> they got these Nike ID Pendleton Roches right here. Pretty crazy. See right there, it says Pendleton in the back. These are custom IDs. Pretty crazy. Tommy Hill figure, button up. Five bucks. It's got the crest right there. They got all these blockhead hats right here. But they're all in pretty bad condition. So I didn't have to leave them all. But pretty dope to come across it. Found this Mickey vintage Mickey crew neck. It's got the little under piece right here. And then Mickey Unlimited. Nothing on the back. This might be a cop. Eight dollars though. We'll see. Got this Pendleton robe right here. Just got back home. Um, I have a few more errands to run today. Gotta go pick up the Pops medicine. Looks like I got a package from eBay. Can't show you guys my address, but uh, yeah, let's go unbox this. I'll show you guys what I picked up. there picked up the Tommy jacket the kids one that you guys saw picked up the vintage 49ers tee crazy t-shirt and then the dead stock logo athletic let's go got the box let's open it up let's see oh ho, ho. This person decided to wrap it up like a present Christmas This feels way thicker than I would think it would be. I honestly only ordered a t-shirt. Vintage values, it says, Thank you for your order. I hope you have a great day. Please leave me a review if you thought I did a good job. Thanks again. So, got a pretty cool little note right there. I honestly have no idea why this thing feels so thick. only a t-shirt. Imagine it's a crew neck. That'd be dope. <laughs> what is that? 
Is this a joke? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. This is not what I ordered. Open now. I want to see what it is. Shane, are you messing with me? No, I swear. It was packaged. You're a freaking <laughs> liar. Dude. I am not. I swear. I put I put all my life. Wait, what is that though? Oh, nice. This is not the t-shirt. <laughs> this is my girlfriend's snowboarding pants <laughs> that I ordered her. Oh, shoot. Nice. These are not white. <laughs> These are not white. They're cream. This is a pair of North Face snowboarding pants. The boo-boo needed a pair for Tahoe. So, yeah. Your package came in the mail, boo-boo. Hey, those are nice. Mm. The boo-boo wanted some white snowboarding pants, but these are small as shit. <laughs> well, that goes high, like what? in your waist. Is it gonna fit her? Oh no, has oh, it adjustable? It, yeah. Dude, I was like, oh, not that much. <laughs> Is that gonna fit her? No, that'll fit her. It will? Yeah. Yeah, I should have Dang, sorry, boo-boo. These are not white, they're cream, but it's too late now. We're going to Tahoe in two days, so. Alright. Nice! I have another package coming in later, but this is not what I expected this I'm to dying. be. I'm nice. dying. I'm dying. Back in my car. I am headed to the pharmacy to pick up my dad's medicine. And then there's actually a Goodwill located very close by to the pharmacy. So I'm gonna hit that pharmacy and then. Um, Go to the Goodwill and then see what I can find there. Uh, but yeah, hope we can find some flame. Let's go. Gotta lock my car. Just got to Goodwill. Um, actually, gonna make some exchanges real quick because these pieces didn't sell. I'll teach you guys how to buy and sell without uh, spending any money. You feel me? Let's go. Goodwill. So I found this Tommy Hilfiger fleece right here. I don't know if it's real, honestly, but it's still a dope piece regardless. They're charging $16.99 though, so it's kind of up there. I'm not sure about this piece. But I found this satin Samstown jacket. Pretty clean. Samstown winner right there, and then on the inside, it's got a whole bunch of Samstown logos, and then it says Samstown Las Vegas in the back. This is a pretty dope jacket. Might have to pick this up. Found this Tommy Hilfiger knitted sweater, vintage flag, dope sweater. And then I found this North Face jacket. Might have to pick this up for my girl. We'll see. Have to check if anything's wrong with it first. And then found this Mitchell ass snapback right here, Chicago. Not sure if I'm gonna keep it though. We'll see. So I ended up actually just exchanging some pieces for the Tommy fleece. I'm actually not sure if it's real, uh, but most likely will be for sale. Uh, headed to pick up my dad's medicine now. But yeah, after I pick up the medicine, I'm gonna go home because I gotta cut hair. Um, and then I'm gonna get into editing this video and get it out by tonight. It's extra dark. Let's go. Got the medication. Damn, man, it's always dark. There you go, got some light right there. Got the medication right here. About to head home. And then, oh my chain's inside. About to head home and then cut some hair. Maybe grub a little bit, your boy's hungry. All right guys, see you later.
guys the end of the cut when I'm done with it. Peace. Is it gonna hit? No. Damn, the lighting's bad, huh? No, that's cool. It's okay. All cleaned up. So the little sis told me that she came up on a little piece from Goodwill. So she's gonna show it off to me right now and show it to you guys. So let's see what she found. Damn, with the big ass slippers though. <laughs> These are yours. Stop. Big slippers. <laughs> These are yours. I'm just borrowing them. Let's go. Dude, that would fit me. It just fit it. It would not fit you. It would. I'm pretty sure it's a woman's. Hmm? It's an extra large. Extra large? Yeah. A women's extra large or kids? Dang, so you got that Tommy jeans embroidery right there. It's got the red, white, and blue stripes. And then on the back, well, it's actually got the kangaroo pocket. And then on the back, it's got a whole bunch of nothing. Oh, nice. And then, but yeah, pretty dope piece. Let's go. So I actually came up on this t-shirt right here. It's a DKNYT, DKNY NYC. See right there? Picked it up for $3. Crazy little come up. I can just show you a couple pictures of the t-shirt. It's in really good condition. Nothing on the back, but the logo is just super dope on the front, so I had to pick it up. Let's go. And I just want to go through the pieces that I came up today. Um, so this Tommy piece right here, fleece, just plain color blocking. Uh, picked up this dead stock t-shirt right here. The Scott, Scott Braden, 1995-1996. Back to back winner, very dope piece. Dead stock logo athletic. The kids, Tommy jacket right here. Vintage Tommy, will be for sale. Stay up to date with my IG. And then I found this. Lastly, I got this 1994 San Francisco 49ers nutmeg tea. Very dope front and back screen printing. So, yeah. All right, so now let's get into the winner for the, um, the raffle for the Looney Tunes jersey, the Space Jam jersey, um, the Supreme tea and the Nike Windbreaker. All right guys, so I'm loading in the video right here for the raffle. Loading the comments. All right, now I'm going to randomly pick a winner. And there it is, Josh K. Also, I really like the Supreme shirt and the Space Jam jersey a lot. Let's go. <laughs> Congratulations, Josh K. Uh, just DM me on Instagram and let me know what piece you want. I will coordinate from there and I'll get it shipped out to you. Congratulations once again. Let's go. So yeah, that's the winner. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog once again. I'm gonna wrap up the video right here. Um, but yeah, you guys already know the slogan. So let's wrap it. Uh. Hey. Man, to fashion was good.